What it do, everybody? It's your boy, the minister, the reverend, the chaplain, Jay Whitfield Inspires. Come back at you once again with another video. Y'all know what we're going to do. We're going to get straight into it. So today we're talking about soft-hearted Virgo men. Yes, y'all might not believe it, but Virgo men are very soft-hearted. Or they, are they, or they can be very soft-hearted. I'm going to break down a few things really quickly about soft-heartedness. Because under all that, under that hard shell, under that hiding and ignoring they're very soft-hearted and they have a soft spot for you the first thing is why they're soft-hearted you can tell because they like to help everybody see the virgo is the helper of the zodiac so you gotta understand that some of his criticism towards you is actually he think he's helping you by criticizing you right he this is why he's so critical this is why he's perfectionist because he's soft-hearted he want to see everything in its proper place but people that's close to him he want to help them virgo's attitude is if you're around me, I want to see you at your very, very best, right? So Virgos really, really do care about you. So this is why, just say, if you're with him, you may be a little weight or you gain any weight. He's gonna really push you to lose weight. You know what I'm saying? He'll be there, step. he'll be there with you, going to the gym with you, everything. You know, doing a meal, the meal prep, he's he gonna encourage you. Sometimes it may get a little, it may get a little rough, but it's just because he. He, he honestly cares and he feel like he knows what can get you to a, a better place. He does he does this with everybody in his circle, family, friends, job. Virgos really try to help everybody. And um, this leads me to my next point. In them trying to help everybody, sometimes they give too much. Virgos are the helpers and the givers of the Zodiac. They live to, they live to serve. This is why you'll see Virgo men, well, not just Virgo men, Virgos, period, in um fields of like leadership police officers um anything firefighters you know ceos anything that's that's like a leadership position or a position of influence like me i'm in ministry i'm a chaplain i'm a preacher and stuff like that i have influence and things like that because we serve right and we want to we really want to see everybody help and one thing about it about trying to help everybody is and then we give too much the next thing is sometimes People end up taking advantage of Virgos because they know, at least the people that's close to them, they know that these guys are soft-hearted, right? They know that you can get you, you can get to a Virgo if you if you're close to him, if you if you in his circle, you you, ha you have his ear. Nine, nine times out of ten, he's gonna help you sometimes, even when he don't want to, right? Because he just don't want to see you disappointed. We hate to see people disappointed. It disappoints us when we, people disappoint when we disappoint somebody else. We hate to let people down. So don't take advantage of, Vir of Virgo because it really does hurt him. And this is one reason why Virgos don't open up as much because we know we are vulnerable to being over helpers, right? We are vulnerable to forgiving too much, to helping everybody. And sometimes everybody don't have the best intention. Like we all been through situations before where you may be giving somebody money or whatever, and they keep coming back and asking you and asking you and asking you and asking you. And then, you know, you're afraid to say no. Some of y'all not, but you know, if you, you don't want to say no sometimes, and then one time you do say no, they flip out on you like you never heard them before. That really hurts. It hurts a Virgo because we like, yo, I, I thought we had something. I thought it was cool. I thought we had a connection. I thought it was my friend or my girl, whatever the case may be. I, th I thought you you felt more of that than me. Did I say that right? I thought you thought more of me than that. That's what I'm trying to say. And so this really hurts Virgo. So don't don't take advantage of that kind of because they will give you that last dollar. They will they give you the shirt off their back. You know they'll hurt. They'll help you even if it's hurting them. And sometimes they don't know how to say no. But you don't, at the same time, you don't want to get him to the point where he's saying no. Because we start saying no and this and that, it's going to be real. Because Virgo can do it. They cut off game is strong. Once you out of, once you out of his good graces, you know, you don't want to get there. But, you know, just be mindful that although he's helping you and he's giving you stuff, or whatever the case may be, that you're also taken from him. You need to, ref he needs to be refilled. This is why Virgo spend a lot of time alone. Because we give so much. We give our all in every situation. Look at Y'all know what I'm going to say, Michael Jackson and Beyonce, they gave their life to their craft, right? This is, this is who they are. I know me, when I when I got my heart on something, I'm giving my absolute best because that's what it is. And it comes from that, you know? So don't don't take advantage of them, of their kindness. Don't take advantage of their gifts, their generosity, their love, you know, because it comes strong. And if you're around Virgo, if he loves you and something like that, he's going to make sure you're straight, even if he goes hungry. That's what he's he going to do. You know, I have a lot of homeless people in Atlanta. And stuff like that. And it's hard because sometimes people be scamming. I had to learn to say no. I had to learn to just stop, and it hurts, right? It hurts. We feel guilty and convicted. The next thing is um, 
some, some, sometimes them giving too much and people taking advantage of them can lead to anger. So be careful of that because we soft hearted, but you can hurt us to, to the point where we be extremely angry. And this anger brings on pain. Well, the pain brings on anger, right? And you don't want that because now he, he lashing out, he's saying stuff, and he, you don't you don't want that. That ain't what you want, you know? Because you now you you turn from a frenemy to an enemy. You know what I'm saying? You, you don't want to experience this anger. We all get angry, but you don't want that type of Virgo because it's wrong. If you get to that point, what are you doing? You know, I know it's nuances to this thing, but you know, and we we also saw part of it because we were very passionate. Virgos are very passionate about everything, right? They, they're passionate about life, love, happiness, all this stuff. So their passion runs deep. And you need to notice about this person. And the things that they put their focus on, like their mission in life, their goals in life, they're passionate about it. And they're going to need you to understand that because, you know, they need you to understand his passion, right? Understand that his soft heartedness comes from that passion. He really cares. Like Virgo has the biggest hearts in the world. I'm telling you. Virgos have a heart of gold, you know, and we have to we have to be with somebody who who we can trust with that heart of gold. This is why it's hard to get to a Virgo, right? This is why it's hard to get to that heart because when you get to it, it's pouring out like a well, right? It's it's so pure, it's so passionate, it's so raw, you know. And our passion is not just with love. Our passion is across the board: love, anger, happiness, joy. I'm saying these these are some passionate human beings. And many people don't get the experience. They only get the experience of anger side of passion. But Virgos are, are very, very passionate. And so, uh, so if, if you got a Virgo or you get one, you got to know that you got to have a special person. You really, do. I'm telling you, you have a special person who's gonna love you. Just you're gonna, you're gonna, you're gonna experience a lot of passion come from. This is why sometimes, even if you're not in a relationship with Virgo, y'all bond is very strong. Why? Because he's a passionate person. Virgos do everything out of love, right? Even though sometimes they're angry at you, they probably still will help you. I, I know people who did me wrong. I, I said that before, who've done me wrong, wrong. But then they call me and be like, yo, I, I need you. You know, I'm like, you know, all right. Even, even, even if it hurt me, I ain't wanted to, but I did. And I wouldn't, I wouldn't have been wrong if I said no. But that's just my passion, my love. That's what it is. So when you experience a Virgo's love and you experience his heart, you will really experience his passion, right? And it's, it's like a warm, I don't know. It's like a warm bath or something like that, you know, like a warm shower. I'm telling you what I know because I'm like this, you know, but we can't get that passion to everybody and we can't trust everybody with our hearts. All right. We soft hearted. You know, we Virgos are very, very tender hearted. Y'all hear me when I'm saying this. You may not think so because people say we emotionless. This is just because we protect our emotions and our feelings. But under all that facade is really a, a soft hearted person, you know, really a passion person. That's full of anxiety, that's full of pain, you know, and that's full of trauma, that's full of love, that's full of joy, and just full of happiness. We full of a lot of that stuff, you know what I'm saying? And we just want to pour it out to somebody, but it's hard. It's hard to let go. So that's why some, it's hard for us to love sometimes, but you got to understand you're dealing with somebody who likes to help. And Virgo's going to have a lot of friends, you know, even though we like to keep our circle small, what I'm saying is a lot of people who like to be around us, so to speak, you know, and sometimes it tends it to. Tends, we tend to give too much in that, which hurts. You know, sometimes, I, I, like I said, I had to learn to say no to people. And they think I'm being mean. You know, but we have to learn to step up. We don't like confrontation. Like, we don't like confrontation. We, we shy away from confrontation because we just don't, we don't want to deal with it. It hurts. It hurts. I'm telling y'all. So this is when, when Virgos do get angry. They get real angry because they are so passionate and they're so giving. So when, when somebody does something to them or they feel offended for whatever reason, it comes out in this you know, this jet stream of anger. Because we were like, man, I thought you knew me better than that. You know, have I not shown you who I am? You know what I'm saying? Have, have I not helped you? It really hurts us. It hurts us, like, to the bone, you know? And, like, that's why you don't do a Virgo wrong. You know what I'm saying? And don't take advantage of them because you betray them. You really, you 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 you, you, did, a, you did the wrong thing. You did a bad thing. It's, like, it's almost like betraying somebody who's been good to you. And you're doing it for no reason. Their anger going to be swift. You know what I'm saying? But, yeah, man. So, I am just I just want to, you know, do that quick video about soft-hearted Virgos. We are, I think we are all a little soft-hearted. Some some more hard shell than others. But if you, if you know any Virgos, you know how, how much they care about whatever. 
this is why this is why people like to be around them because they just they so loving and so caring, so soft hearted, and they probably got a soft spot for you. You know, Virgo's got a soft spot for you. We have a soft spot for women. We do, not not necessarily like in a sexual way, but like we tend um, we tend to want want to help women out, right? We tend to want to fix things, you know, and, and this is kind of how we how we do. But you know, everybody don't have best intentions. But anyway. Most likely, if you know him, he has a soft spot for you. And don't take advantage of that. I know a couple of you I got a soft spot for. It's just like, I can't get this person out of my mind. Why I got a soft spot for her? Like, you just want to have her. Like, it's hard to get over. It's frustrating. Because sometimes people don't deserve it. You know. This is day, uh, what, four of me looking straggly. So y'all pray for him. I'm getting out of a little soon. You know, I'm looking fresh. You know, y'all try to hide it when I start looking fresh. You know what I'm saying? New number who it is. But anyway. Soft-hearted Virgo, Virgo, baby. Treat your Virgo right. He'll treat you better. Ow.